Hello, welcome to Aeroshift channel. This tutorial is a continuation of the previous tutorial where uh, we analyzed uh, a beam subjected to lateral load. In this particular tutorial, we are going to look at the two commands uh, called post relief T and uh, imperturbable in uh, Salamameca and Codaster to extract the sum of the reaction forces uh, at a particular selection of nodes. So we generally come across uh, problems where we want to know the reactions at a uh, uh, particular location or a particular node. So this command, uh, this tutorial will help you to uh, set up the code to extract that. So I will show you what I have done and uh, the results output. So here is the, here is the code if you want to use. So these are the two commands, post relief T and uh, Pro table. Now I'll show in Salamameca what I have done. So within Salamameca, the first thing that you need to do is go to the post processing and uh, select the option post relivity. So in that, you have to select the group of nodes so in this particular problem i have a group of nodes called uh, fixed nodes which i have selected the result file from which i want to see the results and what resultant i want to write it to the table so basically i have selected the three components here to write it to the table and uh, what operation i want to do i want to just extract the uh, uh, particular value what value i want to extract i want to extract the reaction node which is known sham here and this is just a variable name that i have given there for this particular uh, problem so that's what you need to define in post relivity then once the table is defined so the variable is called table that table can be output to a particular any specific file so in this case i have written it to a text file called uh, tutorial to reaction force so when we solve the problem the table that is computed into this will be returned to that particular text file so i had solved the problem and i'll show you the result as to how it looks like so in the uh, similar to the because in this tutorial the total load that was applied was 250 newton in y direction that's what i expect to see the total reaction because i have selected all the nodes that are fixed If I go to the output file that was generated, open it up. So as you can see here, so that this is how the output will be. So it is a summation of all the loads in three directions. So dx I have not applied any load, so there's no reaction. That's minus 250, and that's close to zero. Um, you can use this function for uh, many other purposes, and uh, hopefully I will be making a uh, few more tutorials uh, in the future in terms of outputting uh, selected commands or uh, particular uh, uh, stress output so in this tutorial this is all i wanted to show uh, hope you have learned something and thanks for watching